Kindiki kizure by the way is one of us. Lakini kindiki asikubali kutumua vibaya. Ye ni wakili. Ye ni wakili. Na angalie eh, wakati kama huu. Anaweza kuharibiwa sifa. Na mi na mweta ntakaya kwa mbibazis from, <laughs> from Seguro to the record ni karibu sana. Except kwa mba wakati wa maandamani ya 2024. When was a minister responsible for interior. Even as we speak, he's still the minister for the interior. Jensi wali wawa wengi. Na bado wengi hawajilikani waliko. 2023 wali wawa watu wengi. Tukiwa na ndada angu, mapacha, my twin sister. I don't know she used to escape. Me, I was almost killed. Lakini waliangalia mother wakaona hii mwili ni kama ya njiru. They spared her. But they nearly killed us. Lakini mawaji ya 2024 kuwa watoto wengi na mnaeo na uwe wanyo mekubali abductions. Wameshikwa kinyume na sheria. Hawapeleku kwa mahakama. Hawajulikani walipo. Complete and total abuse of human rights of Kenyans. I want to propose wale watoto wa 2024 na 2023 ili kwaenzi kama ni mashuja wetu tomorrow. And my other mashuja ni vijana wetu wa JNC Kenya hii. Tunawaenzi mashuja wetu ha. So that tomorrow we have reason at least to celebrate. Nikija hapa, nimepitia kamodhanga mahali tulimzindikisha kijana uh, Rex Masai up to today hakuna askari hata moja amekamatwa akapelekwa korokoroni ndio tujue ruto na serikali yake have any idea about human feelings hakuna askari hata moja and i want to confirm even the international community wameelewa ruto ni mtu aina gani Sio vile walikuwa wakimuona as we speak things have changed. And the international community is with the Kenyan people. Kwa hivyo hapa tukisherekea hafla hii ya kiajabu. Hatuna bodi hii la pia kujisherekea sisi kama wa Kenya na tujue nchi hii yetu hakuna ambaye anaweza kukotoa wewe haki yako kama mwananchi wa Kenya. Na hakuna hata ambaye ako na haki ya kutoa uhai wako. So we say bunge la Kenya, bunge la Senate na bunge la National Assembly vimetekwa nyara. Hivi ni Raila used to say so. Vimetekwa nyara. By the exact kutekwa nyara aso one of the things my twin sister and my friends are under us to look at because I've been in government. Something called confidential vote in the office of the president. Ndiyo meleta kutekwa nyara wazi wazi watu kununuliwa kama kuku kwa bungi. The first thing we shall get rid of is that confidential vote in the office of the president. Ndiyo wanaichu wajue pesa zao hizi zinatumika kivipi. That is where the center of corruption kwa nji hii. Mukisikia viongozo wa nanunuliwa ni hizo. And by the way, it is not even subject to public accounts of the National Assembly. This is why they can use the billions to do what they have done. Leaders ambao wa mebaki na angalao conscience kidogo kiasi. Tua muke jameni to say me no. Jensi wali ingilia mahakama vacho before justice barasa I was amazed I don't know they got the the coordinates waka ingia ukondani kwa mtandao huku tukisema sisi unataka waka anza kuimba andani must go mjaji waka shanga mambo gani hata I can say now this matter must go before open court. It is in open court on Tuesday. 
my London brother Kibe Mwigai had even introduced him as a for conservatory orders ile international airport yet to isiende na walagai wakapa sema international airport aitaenda I was we will not Ruto you have to kill every Kenyan to get the kind of country you are leading us into we will not agree it will not happen it will not happen therefore our judiciary today ilikuwa kwamba wapate order leo jumamosi siku ambapo wenzetu wa seventh day adventist walikuwa wakienda kanisani na kuingineko as we have had walikuwa wapate hiyo order ndiyo deputy president mpya apishwe leo that was the purpose and i said on citizen interview and probably a lot of you will have watched ilisema we knew that on friday there was going to be a special sitting of the national assembly to approve the outcome of the senate meaning they had already anticipated debate before the senate so the senate kwanza mngekatalia maneno asema this is already anticipation it is illegal it is in in in, in contravention of the standing orders of both the senate and the national assembly lakini kaendelea hivi juma ijuma kafanyika on my way nilipitia karibu pale na huru gardens it was purpose kwamba kitoka kwa national assembly was it yesterday walikuwa kitoka hapo on a friday walikuwa wote waandamane wa, wa mpaka uhuru gardens because katiba inasema the deputy president must be sworn in uh, openly uh -huh. it is very clear the state stipulated so walikuwa wamepanga kila kitu leo nimeona wamekuwa natoa tuwapigia pipi wananchi wa Kenya makofi kwa sababu wametoa hiyo walikuwa wanatoa mahema na kila kitu meaning at least they could not proceed it must have been that the chief justice must have said must have told them we can't do this we will not swear we will not swear your candidate and now a lot of things Kenyans on social media are really they are people are amazing i didn't i have not checked that before you become deputy president or president or something you should not be a public you should not have been a public officer for at least six months it is there it is there that's a law so and kidore kidore is a senior lawyer himself he should have seen that he should have advised his boss we should not be incensed we should not be so preoccupied with the present the press the presence of kitugano utapata ndio uharibu hata sifa ya inchi 